We are the Norwegian Black Jazz Band Shining, playing at the Underworld in Camden, London. Thanks for watching us. say it's black jazz uh, which is taken from uh, the title of our album in 2010 called black jazz uh, which is a, a mix of um, the word black metal and the word uh, free jazz we uh, after we played our first show we was in the car and back to Oslo and we had a brainstorming session and we chose shining um, I wish I'd uh, saved the paper with all the suggestions but uh shining is the only one i i remember one more but i won't tell you but the shining <laughs> shining is the one we chose it's uh, obviously from the movie the stanley kubrick movie which is based upon the stephen king f uh, book i uh, when i was a kid i grew up with metal music i listened to pantera slayer no not slayer pantera sepultura death and entomb those were my four main bands. I started playing the sax at age nine and I have no idea why I started playing the sax because I didn't hear I didn't listen to any jazz music at the time. Uh, after a few years I started studying I started getting into jazz music just kind of to, to learn the theory you know behind chord changes and scales and stuff like that and then I started liking jazz after a couple of years and when I was kind of 15 years, 14, 15 years old, I was totally into jazz music, like worship John Coltrane. So we started out as a jazz quartet. And after a while, I got a bit tired of doing only that. So um, we started incorporating new uh, elements from the metal music that I loved when I was a kid and also newer metal music that I discovered which led to Black Jazz in 2010. Yeah, uh, my name is uh, Hans Frunes. I uh, am uh, kind of a sub for the main guitar player, Håkon Sagen. My na name is Erik uh, Knudsen. Um, uh, play the keyboards. I've been here for two years now. Uh, my name is uh, Tobias. I play the drums in uh, Shining. <laughs> My name is Ole. I play bass. I joined the band for a couple of shows in front of thousands of people in France and Belgium, and then was straight to Trolltunga all the way, <laughs> <laughs> all the way to the pointy end of that thing. So, <laughs> thank you guys. <laughs> uh, I prefer playing on the stage. I am really glad that we did the stupid thing, but <laughs> <laughs> I really, really prefer playing on the stage. Yeah, a lot of people discovered us with Black Jazz and after Black Jazz, and a lot of people think that Black Jazz is our first album, and I'm fine with that. You know, if they want to look into our history before that, it'll probably explain to them uh, why we have the kind of unusual. Uh, attitude to playing the music we do. I think it's totally fine starting with black jazz. Uh, London is a, is a, an important city in an important country um, for any band. And for us, it it's been uh, slower than if you, than if certain other places in Europe. We see a lot of great feedback and a great attention in the media, which has been really good. Um, They've been backing us like since Black Jazz. So we see festivals are, are kind of embracing us and the fans are also starting to 
to really embrace us now, which is really good to see because we've, um, like I said, an, any band wants to to uh, grow and become big in the UK. It's it's a big market. It's a lot of people. It's got a lot of history when it comes to creating music. So uh, I don't remember your question, but that's my answer. We're gonna do a lot of tours, touring, uh, playing the festivals uh, in the summer. So basically, take over the world. Yes. I think uh, you're doing the right thing. If you're um, if you're still playing shows, still going to concerts, and living your life as you want to live your life, there's nothing more to say. Just stop that st shit, and then we need to live our life as we want to, and we can never let anyone um, try to stop us from that with violence. We play in a in a rock band basically, and rock band is fun. It's about having a good time, but a few times in the life you come in a situation where rock music entertainment means more than just fun and having a good time and yesterday was one of those days it was very very special atmosphere in the venue people went crazy the we went crazy and people were very emotional after the show and everything was something that you I hope I never experienced it again in that context but we were there and I'm really proud of that yeah. 